the Canon GL1 circuit 1999. <laughs> this is what I record all my videos with. Can a $300 AI software turn footage from a 20 year old camcorder into crispy HD like this? Today we're testing out a software that promises to turn SD into HD, HD into 4K. In other words, give new life to old home videos and archival footage. Let's find out if this AI software is really worth it. Deepfake, Adobe Sensei, DaVinci's Neural Engine, the world is changing with artificial intelligence and machine learning. What before was impossible is now happening right before our eyes. I recently came across a software called Topaz Video Enhanced AI, and I thought maybe this can upscale video, clean up some of the compression artifacts, and fill in that missing information. So let's see if this will work. By the way, this isn't a sponsored video. I'm just really curious to see if this is a viable option for remastering old footage. Our subject here is from 1993. I couldn't keep the girls off me at that time. We'll drag and drop a clip into Topaz and set in and out points. Now this is standard definition from a compact VH camcorder and we can expect interlacing. So inside the AI model panel, we'll choose the best settings that describe the video. Low, interlaced, and high compression as the video artifact type. From the suggested AI models, I'll choose Dion interlaced robust dehalo. That was a mouthful. Output size HD, and add some grain. Then hit render. Now let's see the before and after. And let's take a look at this in a side-by-side -side view. Let's zoom in really far to see what's going on here. Now, I wouldn't say this looks as good as native HD, but it definitely took out some of the blurriness, the details seem more defined, and compression artifacts like chromatic aberration have disappeared. But overall, I'd say it's an improvement. On this next test, let's see if we can turn 720p, which is on the lowest rung of the HD ladder, into crisp 4K. This is from my wedding day, and I think my wife is gonna be impressed that I'm enhancing her to 4K. No, I'm just kidding, she probably isn't gonna care. I'll set in and out points, set the video quality to medium for 720p, video type progressive, video artifact type none, and I'll try the Proteus 6 AI model, which lets us tweak several different parameters. Finally, let's make sure we set the output size to 4K, add some grain, and hit render. Let's see the before and after. This one is more interesting to me because it seems to be applying a sophisticated sharpening to our faces, clothing, and even the wall in the background. But if you take a look at my wife's hair, it actually looks as if more detail has been added. And she's gonna love this as her hair was inspired by Kate Beckinsale from the movie Click. Based on these tests, Topaz Video Enhanced AI can definitely improve the quality of your old footage. Not in a way that it's gonna magically turn SD into HD or 4K, and it's probably not gonna work with every shot. But if you are in need of a good upscale that removes compression and noise artifacts, it is a solid choice. On the other hand, it comes at a high price at $299 for a license. The question I have for you is, would you pay that much to enhance the quality of archival footage? Let me know in the comments. For paid jobs where you're working with archival footage for say a documentary, this makes sense to get the best quality. Now enhancing the resolution is only one part of the equation, the other part is color. And since we are color grading central, we have a lot of videos on color grading to help with remastering the look of old films, so check those out. And for an even easier way to get cinema quality, we have a special software tool that lets you do point and click color grading right in the viewer, and it has a guided step-by-step -step workflow, so there's absolutely no guesswork. Just apply a base correction, match clips together, and apply a final look grade. If you wanna find out more about Cinema Grade, you'll find a link for it in the description below, and if you use YouTube 20 at checkout, you can get 20% off your purchase for a limited time. It works in Premiere Pro, DaVinci Resolve, and Final Cut Pro 10 on the Mac, and soon coming to Windows. For more videos like this, click the subscribe button and then the bell to be notified of our next one. I'll see you in the next video. Let's make Cinema Grade video.